with the soaring free, but the Bold Venture field is ready. They're off, and what a great start, but told it all in the center of the track. Patches O'Houlihan goes through very comfortably in the center. Old Chestnut the outside. Behind them, Super Watson up the rails going through his county final. Right behind them, last American exit joins the main pack. A length away came Secret Reserve, who's tucked up on the inside. And towards the back in the early part is Super Watson, and last about a length in behind them now is on the outside. Candy Overload, Border Town got back, and showing the way by two lengths, Patches O'Houlihan from Old Chestnut, last American exit. On the outside, going forward is Super Watson around the outside of Told It All. And back on the rails is still County Final. Border Town just a length away as Patches O'Houlihan opens right up. Then Secret Reserve. Last is Candy Overload. The three-year-old in front. Patches O'Houlihan by three lengths to Old Chestnut. Last American exit on the inside. A length away, Super Watson. Border Town started to wind up nicely around the outside. And behind them as they turn for home, Told It All. Top of the stretch, Patches O'Houlihan in front. Last American exit up the inside. Down the center, Old Chestnut. And then came Border Town. Last American exit's come up on the inside to join Patches O'Houlihan. And now Old Chestnut, Patches O'Houlihan. On the inside is still Last American exit. Then Old Chestnut. And Patches O'Houlihan is going to hold on and win the bold venture and draws off by a length. It is Patches O'Houlihan first. Last American exit second. Old Chestnut was third. Then a photo secret reserve with Super Watson. And the time, 115.34. In the Johnny Walker's winner's circle with the connections of Patches O'Houlihan, the winner of this year's Bold Venture. A wire-to-wire -wire score here for this horse. Daisuke Fukumoto doing the riding. Now tell me about your trip. I mean, obviously you were sitting pretty out there, but then the whole field came to you. What happened? Right, you know, I look at the form, you know, no much speed in the race, but, you know, anything going to happen, right? But, you know, I just rode simple, you know, he broke good. Then, you know, I just slowly go inside, then I took lead. But, uh, you know... He carry 123, uh, 123 pounds, and uh, he's only three years old, right? <laughs> it, it, it was a tough trip for him. Really, today, you know, he, he tried hard. But, you know, he's a nice horse. He went, when came horse beside him, then he took off again. That was absolutely fantastic. A great ride. Let's bring Bob Tiller in. I know you yes. got to get ready. Congratulations on the win. Thank you. All right, Bob. This okay. was pretty awesome, buddy. <laughs> uh, people uh, were questioning. They were saying, yeah. you know, three rolled in against the older horses. Me, your old pal, I said, I don't discount Bob Tiller. He's in the Hall of Fame for a reason. You mm. wouldn't put this horse in this race if I you didn't that, think, actually. thank you, if you didn't <laughs> think you had a legitimate shot to win. So tell me yeah. about the uh, putting the horse in the race and your feelings going into the race. Well, I got to tell you a little story. Frank DeGiulio Jr. and his wonderful family are watching right now at Del Mar. That's if the hurricane, hurricane didn't get them. They had a trip uh, three years ago that they had to cancel because of COVID. So the whole family's there watching. It's a big thrill. I'm going to give Frank a lot of credit. I test, we test each other. You know, it's like a marriage, you know. We were, we were together 43 years. So I didn't like it at first. Uh, I just thought we were, you know, older horses. Let's wait for the Fort Erie race, whatever. But at the end of the day, uh, uh, this is a super, super good horse. It sure is, Bob. And, you know, I don't understand he's a pink lord, but uh, he's a super good horse. And this is a big thrill for me, and I'm just thrilled. We are thrilled, too. Congratulations. Patches O'Houlihan takes this year's running of the Bold Venture.